Hello everybody, welcome to Monday Night Claw. I'm Jimmy Ventura. In the booth with me is Faimir and Rick Shavani. Hello. Hello. Fans of the Lucha Libre, here we are, another Monday Night Clock coming straight to your basement. <laughs> oh, baby, i got a scotch in my hand, Monday Night Clock in front of my eyes, and a pussy in my lap. Does life get any better than this? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Why I don't get any of that, you know? Bloody... <laughs> anyway, we start a mystery wrestler coming to face a... Uh... Borg Pagor, the parody of a man, became a parody of his man and they managed to get the belt and now it's time to defend it. Versus all comers. Yeah, he's uh, done a great job so far. As we keep saying, definitely a new man since he attained the haunts. And uh, yeah, I just think whoever he is against, he is a big favorite here. <laughs> yep. Right, let's, there you let's go. See. Who's gonna be? Who's gonna be the the contender? <laughs> the following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Underground Championship. Who's it gonna be? Oh, <laughs> here come more Pobla. <laughs> Horns on horns. He, maybe he's got the one answer to, to Volkvagor with his own set of horns. Uh, yeah, this could be anybody's. <laughs> yes, clashing of horns here. You're going to need a bullfighter at this point in the GFW. <laughs> yeah. And here comes Morporak. <laughs> that is doing uh, well with Amazons in the CCL uh, Cup. To Timmy G said uh, his demise. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> Previously, uh, tag team specialist with Space Cadet, but of course, Space Cadet now heavily involved in the quad skulls, so they're pretty much no more. More Plovac now making his first step on his new path, striking out for the Web Dope Championship. Absolutely. <laughs> Those are a hard count of a piece, man. But here we go. I'm going to get a cup of tea. All right, not even Jimmy wants to see this. Here comes Volk Fagor, previously known as Volcayo, now sold his soul to the Chaos God and the cheap surgeries of the GFW uh, locker room, Reaper Dog, and now he's coming. Indeed, it's uh, Germany versus Croatia. It's chaos versus Norse. Wait, who's who's which? Who's Germany and who's Croatia? <laughs> but, uh, Volkvagor was was at least previously from Germany before uh, the forces of chaos took him. I don't know oh, who right. he represents now. More for like, uh, from Croatia, so probably you know is the stockholder of the Jimmy Fantastic Chocolate is there. So yeah, this could be a great fight. What a tighter fight here, the wind up tighter. Introducing the challenger from Valhalla. Wing pretty, uh, from Valhalla. pretty similar in the size department, would you say, for me? Fairly even physical matchup here. Uh, I say yes. Yes, I mean, both Pagor has bigger horns, but the... <laughs> and a, a little bit more muscle since he became a Fagor, particularly the thighs. Yes, like, but as, as a he's... squatting specialist, like, what do you think of those thighs? Maybe too hairy, and the fact that there is nothing under the skirt, you know, tells me that maybe Borg Fagor sacrifices a little too much. Hmm. Fair. Or maybe he never has enough anyway, so... <laughs> now more Polak. Pink, Polka Dots, always a winner. <laughs> the, 
the WWE rock sign was like half covered up there and I swore it said WWE sucks until the guy moved out of the way. <laughs> oh, even start so far. Volk with the first blow, but more blowback turning it around. Big head. Love there you go. Suplex. Frenzy and Block versus Horns, a mighty blow. The eternal debate. Oh my goodness, kick to the back, but more Plovac, uh, sorry, Volk not even feeling it with the muscle etched in his back there, giving him lots of protection, and more Plovac unceremoniously dumped out of the ring. Oh, more Plovac is going to need to do something now, because now Volk, well, complete failure there. Yeah, gives more Plovac the chance to recover. Oh, double hit there. Oh, another one, but dodge. Oh. oh. And I don't think that helmet is going to protect much of the pro more Polak's head. <laughs> it's the only armor he's got, isn't it? Uh, yes. Yeah. Nice work outside the ring, doing that extra damage on the concrete into the ring post. Really, really hard surfaces to get rammed into. More Plovac tries to recover, but stomped straight back down by Volk. He's, he's not giving him a second to breathe, cranking the neck, trying to get the helmet off, trying to remove the horns. He wants to be the only horny JFW superstar. And again, a uh, massive uh, image of Volk's crotch, which is absolutely you know, unnecessary, but... Armbar, Volk doesn't tap though. Very proud Wemdope champion. He's been showing off about it in every stream chat going. He is not going to give up that easily. Currently in a sleeper as well though. He is struggling a little bit at the moment. Fighting no, out with no, his strength. Fighting out, fighting out. Nobody can hold Volk Fagor. But oh, 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 oh Oh, God. Oh, God. This should be illegal. <laughs> the mountain pin. <laughs> the Wells special. Oh, he's going to the middle rope. We don't see this very often. Oh, no, middle rope. What's going to happen here? More are in trouble. <laughs> oh. But a low effort maneuver. <laughs> was that horns to the gut? I, I'm not really sure what it was, but it did a thing. This could be over. Oh. No. Oh, oh, nearly there. Oh. That was very nearly it, but more Plovac is not done yet. I feel like Volk needs the uh, bezel pixelation. <laughs> this is weird. Yes, this is... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, there is nothing to pixel, you know? That, that's the thing. It's absolutely smooth and uh, <laughs> empty. Animal genitalia is, is nothing faux pas. There's nothing to be ashamed about. You know, it's just part of nature. <laughs> oh, oh, that's oh, 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 oh. Right back oh. into this one. Tom Rope, if he lands this, he could be the new champion. Oh god, the moon's Oh my god! Oh, oh no. What a counter! <laughs> oh, the old fashioned clothesline hanging him out on the top rope. And now go for the finish! Will Plovak tap? <laughs> Brutal oh, no, money no. over there. Absolute lack of humanity in uh, Borfavor. <laughs> Not that he had a match before. Oh, what a power move here, one more Poblak. He's hurt though, holding up to the arm. Oh! Wow. Might have been faking. Oh, look at Volk pop up, <laughs> the power of chaos. Oh, he's boy. in him, it's flowing in his veins, and he surely got the win there. <laughs> On the ropes, I think, that one. Yeah, Ref breaking it up. 
Oh, no, we and now ball getting the love of the crowd. Oh, middle rope again. <laughs> getting ready, getting pump up. So you got to catch this. Come on, buddy, get out of the way. Oh, there oh, you go. Boards to I the think face. that's it. I think that's it. More Polak sent packing home. There See you man. go. What a web dope champion. Volkvigor, the most dominant we've had in a long time. Using those horns to such good effect and uh, sending the other horns packing. <laughs> yeah. Can't feel too bad about Norse losing, but... <laughs> you yeah, exactly. It's bad. More Polak, you know. Nice to see a match from more Povak standing on his own two feet after his uh, love affair with Space Cadet has <laughs> been cut short. And yes, Space Cadet, you know, left him for having a better chance with the quad schools, not needing to work there. <laughs> well, Povak now, of course, could focus on his uh, big chalice match against Dionysian this week, having a great run. Oh, yeah. He's, he's not Dionysian uh, Dwarves. Yeah, that's right, yeah. And he's uh, Amazons. Yeah, yeah, we, we don't have to talk about uh, who's the favorite in that match necessarily. Uh, it's good that he's got there. <laughs> Woo. Well, he reached very far, but yeah. <laughs> Glorious. What a champ. He's been looking pretty unbeatable, hasn't he, since he's got the belt? Oh, but yeah, I'm really enjoying yes, this. Uh, once this he got the, the belt. I mean, it doesn't change the fact that as a human, uh, or as a creature, it's a disgrace. But <laughs> he's a champion. <laughs> he is a champion. And speaking of champions, neither of these are. But what a match. It's Rick oh, Reckless oh. versus Pepper Biscuit. Oh, my with God. Incredible, yeah. Both with something huge to prove. Pepper Biscuit losing to Goliath Games last week. Very surprising shock. So he wants to bounce back and show his dominance. No one doubts what he can do. Uh, Rick, of course, still on the road to recovering his title from Night Demon after having his leg broken at Hell in a Cell. And uh, yeah, so yeah, this is uh, absolutely everything on the line here. Rick also going out of Chalice this week. No, oh, yeah, he did, didn't he? But at least yes, he, yes, yes. he did well. He did well. He, did well. he it took, was an amazing. He effort. took Andy Davo to the last turn of the extra time and having making him have to do GFIs to win. Yeah. That's as close probably as you can get in a Chalice game. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Whoa! Rick. Careful! Careful, Rick! Oh, oh no! God. Oh god! <laughs> oh god! Gengar going oh, off to the leg! The sledgehammer! Oh my god! Gengar, the best tag team partner in the JFW! <laughs> Isn't he just? Listen! What the hell? Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, that was quick! <laughs> Gengar, true, loyal, true, absolutely, <laughs> but the kind of asshole you want in your corner. <laughs> wow. Well, there you go. <laughs> Sorry about that, everybody. Uh, shame we had to not have that match, but there you go. Gengar saw to it. The absolute, the, the best, the, he really is unbelievable tag team partner. He managed to come out and stop that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> What, okay, what are we the say, rest of Quad was... Skulls going to be thinking now? Are they going to be in the right frame of mind for this match after seeing that? Exactly. They, I have to say that probably that will be the quickest victory for Rick Resilis, but uh, what a prize. What a prize. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I wonder if he's going to be back on, back in the injury list like after that. That was a savage, a, a savage risk, real risk. <laughs> it was. I tell you what, I might not want to be north and south here. There might be a very, very angry quad skulls about to turn up in this match. There might be, yeah. Boy, howdy. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see if Cloud Schools was their opinion and what is the reaction about the uh, Rick uh, Bicius and Hilarious attack by Gengar. <laughs> yeah, Ducky, I'm, I'm a bit kind as well. <laughs> that would have been good. <laughs> <laughs> Gengar, pile it on on your hopes and dreams. Yeah. Well, 
Here they are, they're looking angry. I mean, they're always angry, <laughs> but they're looking especially rowdy tonight. <laughs> rowdy! So they're gonna get, you know, they need answers, but first they need to be the north and south. Mm. Jack yeah, Lord, he uh, like answers, but first he needs to work out the questions. Fucking hell, he cracks me up every time. Clearly, Gengar was defending himself. That was self defense, Texas style. <laughs> oh, here we go. Okay, yeah, this thing seems going to as expected. No surprises now, but two legends here, two pals, <laughs> two blocks. <laughs> yeah, they've picked up some great wins. They've not been in the title scene for a while. Um, they'll want to start climbing that ladder again. But yeah, very, very capable tag team, North and South. One more capable than the other, but... Uh... <laughs> 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 and they sure look good doing it, that's the most important That's part. it, they enjoy it, they, they have fun doing it, that's the most important part. <laughs> the true prize is the friendships you do along the way, say every single loser. <laughs> so, uh, pr predictions on who will start for, uh, for Quad Skulls, guys? <laughs> will it be Elliot? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's not going to be Jack Bull, which by the way, the other day, I catch uh, five minutes of uh, Jack Bull's stream, and he already has to do people or maybe him like a hundred uh, push-ups. Oh, oh wow! <laughs> Have we seen him before as a manager? This would be interesting to see how he performs. Yeah. There you go. There you go. The puppy in the back from the space cadet. <laughs> to Helios. There you go, pal. You got this. Oh, oh. what a start, though! It's all drop kick. <laughs> Incredible elevation from Elliot. Oh, man. I thought this might happen, you know. They're really peeved. They are so frustrated at Gengar. And they're, they're extracting revenge and taking out their frustrations on North and South. Not North and South's fault, of course, but they're the <laughs> only ones that they can take it out on. Yep. I'm not sure, you know, maybe there are changes coming to quad schools. After all, Rick is fighting for a total of 30 seconds every week. Meanwhile, Elliot is having to deal with everything. <laughs> You know, what kind of leader is the one that is never there? Well, I, I, I think he says quality, not quantity, right? <laughs> Tell that to Gengar. <laughs> <laughs> Which has the quantity and the quality. <laughs> Very true. Very true. Oh, the weight there on the back of Elliot. That's got to do some damage. Fight back well, though. Knee to the face. You do with a tag. I feel <laughs> whether space will want to give it to him is another matter. <laughs> Would you want to get in with, with the, the Scotty? Look at that! Oh, not if he's doing Look that! Look at that, is Scotty, what agility! <laughs> wow! Unbelievable! Hello, snow, baby! Oh, Clearly, he's, he's been uh, taking some protein bars. <laughs> and the DDT, all that weight landing on their head of De Scotty and Elliot go for the tag now. This is nice work from Quad Skulls. Come on, Elliot, you've got to make that tag. Good boy. He does it. There you go, nice face cadet. Oh, Fucking it up in the way. first second. <laughs> the man is to recover. Oh, has oh, he tagged Elliot back in already? <laughs> course, <laughs> Great yes. strategy from Space Cadet. What a cameo. What a maneuver. What a maneuver. <laughs> did story, did do almost dominantly like in the end. Yeah, yeah, absolutely amazing run from Vault with the Wemdo. Yes, Storm. By the way, Storm, there are legends, oh. rumors talking about the uh, you have been at Volk Fagor's uh, place this weekend. <laughs> Yeah. Anything oh, you want go, to comment? A submission win. <laughs> oh no, Scott is too strong. He is. Powers out beautifully. No answer. He, he come in and save. He, he trusted his partner there, and I think that's fair enough. 
He clearly, Scotty clearly found a Greg still opening Darlington at this time of night. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Elliot! Oh boy, package power oh driver. Oh boy. Jesus. Will Space make the save? He doesn't always. What's the strategy this week, Space? Nope. Oh, oh, two or three hundred percent, hundred percent trust in uh, Elliot there. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I, uh, Elliot really needs that tag, but he's completely unconscious at the moment. <laughs> he's absolutely been bodied here so far. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh no, space, space Cadet space. asking for the tag. Yeah, well, no. tried, but he Just when this is absolutely impossible to get it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <him> space Cadet. <laughs> Keep up appearances. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, this is devastating. <laughs> and now, yeah, Anti taking brutal advantage of this. Showing that he's the brains of the operation. Oh, Elliot fighting back after Anti bits with a stop. Go Watch for the tag, Elliot. Attack. Oh, yes. Yes, good. I've done it. I've done it. Space is in. Can Space pick up the glory and get the win now that Elliot's done the work? <laughs> oh! That was a nice move in there by Space Cadet. Well, doesn't let him make the tag. That's good strategy there from Space. He's thought this one through. Keeping him in the middle of the ring. Oh no, going into his corner. Oh! oh. Spirit to DDT. What a counter! What a counter! Or, or it was self inflicted. Who knows with the space cadet? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Ansi, extremely technical and a strong uh, competitor. Ansi forgetting the space cadet spent about 30 seconds cumulatively in the ring so far and not <laughs> ready for a pin. <laughs> it was Ansi being a prick there. <laughs> He is a bit of a prick, isn't he? <laughs> Looks like a tennis coach in a Porsche gym or something like that. Oh, wow. oh it takes too oh, long. Great counter. Wow, great counter. There you go, space. Risky That's maneuvers. That's it. But the problem the is. He's there a while and he eats the turnbuckle. Man. Oh, double punch there to the guards. Blocked by Ansi. No, There's he the gets tag. Space could be in trouble. Oh, oh. Too quick? No. <laughs> Scotty too powerful. Tags Ansi back in. <laughs> what the hell is going on here? This is absolute madness. Oh, <laughs> my God. Wow. The agility from this guy. That was even less time in the ring than Space Cadet's first venture. It really was. Oh, Space Cadet counters the hole, there you go, punching. Oh, he's going to hold wow. for the pin, no, nice maneuver though. Oh, he's going up! Oh man, is this the elbow? There you go, there getting ready, Space flying oh. there, straight into the nuts. Scott is in. Scott in, Elliot in, <laughs> Elliot takes his... Sometime. Oh, to Scotty lays out Space Cadet. Both the legal competitors <laughs> down, but then Elliot on to Scotty. Wow. Oh, Elliot owning the ring. And he's got no one to protect him. <laughs> oh, here the comes elbow. elbow. Again. <laughs> oh, thought he was going to go for a submission, softening him up, though. <laughs> Nice counter from Ansi. He's out there on his oh. own. He's, oh, super kick. Oh, what a combo. What <laughs> a combo by Ansi. Wow. Space is counting sheep right now. Elliot needs to make the and save, but there's no disguise to stop him. Yeah. Easily does so. Still no disguise. Never thought I'd say this, but Space might want to tag Elliot sometime soon. Yep, here it is. Oh, the most Elliot looks dying no, on the outside. He? he does. Oh, careful there. <laughs> careful Space, you don't want to be there. Oh! Oh, oh. oh. oh my God. Apron. To Scott, he's back now as well. North and South getting back in control of this matchup. Absolutely. 
Oh, <laughs> what the kick. kick. <laughs> what skulls could do with Jabal getting involved. Mm. Right there, but he's keeping his distance. Space each steps. Oh, and now more space. Managed to counter. Since the back to the ring. Made the tag space. No. I mean, Elliot doesn't look very well. It seems he, he has eaten something in, uh, oh. that he shouldn't. Oh, now he's once so the tag. He's in. Oh. Beautiful kick by been Elliot. for so long. Oh, but he makes the tag. It's oh, the two wow. fresh men. And there's no help on the outside. If someone can get a finish and a pin in, Elliot pops up <laughs> between a massive boot. And again, there's oh, no wow. way in Elliot. He's in pervious <laughs> pain until he gets punched in the face. That that does hurt him. Yeah. <laughs> he absolutely flattened by that. Oh, and it's the three amigos. Three amigos coming here. That's the thing that Elliot is lacking. Three amigos. <laughs> 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 no one to save him. Yeah. Chapel doesn't make the distraction. Space doesn't make the save, and it's all done. Oh man. All done here. North and South get a victory here. What skulls <laughs> reeling from what they saw happened to their fourth skull, Rick Reckless, just a moment ago. Their head's not quite correctly in the game. <laughs> yeah, a little bit off I don't know. Time. I've seen them making performances like this before. <laughs> and a space seemed like he had it there, but oh man, yeah, calling out the old fresh was <laughs> was yes, that was you know positive <laughs> thinking, positive <laughs> thinking at their best. Great there you go. <laughs> the last do it again. <laughs> These two guys remind me of the friendship of that book of about mice and men. I'm pretty sure I never uh, finished the book, but I'm pretty sure the book ends, you know, in a happy ending. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. What a great performance. And Goliath saying not as good as me. Well, we've got Goliath next. Taken on one of the few things in the GFW bigger than him. <laughs> it's Crusher. Wow. Crusher. Boy, howdy. The definition of being able to do the best and the absolute worst. Always a surprise. Surprise. <laughs> yeah, you never know what you're going to get from Crusher. A bit of a wild animal. Sometimes fails that two plus, but he can be an absolute beast and uh, pick up some huge wins. Goliath Games on a collision course for the world title if uh, if he keeps putting away these opponents. Yeah, unbelievable, yeah, wasn't it? Using Being the classic this. tactic of injuring every single opponent. <laughs> yep. And here we go. What an entrance from Crusher! Oh, this brings me back to my childhood when I saw the Ultimate Warrior for the first time. <laughs> Absolutely amazing! There you go! <laughs> Crusher gonna crush! Ah, yeah! The intensity is almost unpalpable. Absolutely. Awesome presence from Crusher. Even Goliath Games has got to feel this a little bit. He's buffing Boyne around. Versus Crusher is the true test of the GFW. What makes you know you're a true fighter or just a wannabe needs to go through Crusher. <laughs> and will Crusher be able to resist the sexual magnetism of Goliath Games? Because Goliath Games is not a horse. Well, Crusher is a Minotaur after all, with the head of a horse, which means, you know, chaos is like that. <laughs> yep. And there you go, Goliath Games. Absolutely trending on Tinder right now. <laughs> oh, 
baby. Here comes the tank. <laughs> the gun is loaded. Is there any stopping? Get ready to get off? wrecked. Talking of quads and uh, and thighs, for me, like Goliath Games in contention for the for the best in the JFW, I think. I mean, Goliath Games can be in contention for whatever he wants. I'm not gonna argue with him. <laughs> Randy Tanner making the actual real question. <laughs> no, I don't know. Maybe not as many as before, because now I've got this whole plan for the brand split. We'll see. We'll see what happens. So maybe not that many. We shall see. I have to like spend a Wednesday or something working out. Yeah. You wanted to feel ever as jailbait, Goliath can make that feel for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do it. The immovable force meets the unstoppable object. Absolute beasts of nature, these two. And I, goodness knows, your guess is as good as mine. Oh, look at that straight away. We find out. Oh, and again. What an absolute monster Goliath Games is. Crusher can't believe it. He can't God. move him. Three times. Oh, look, what? Is look at the going look in on? the eyes of Crusher. Crusher can't believe what's happening. Oh, and now he finally he's gets him down. down. Fifth time of asking, though. Wow. Oh! Get dominated, Crusher. I, I have a favorite for this match now. <laughs> <laughs> and you could say GG. Oh. <laughs> oh! What a strength. Look at the power! Tossing him over his shoulder. Unbelievable strength. <laughs> wow. That's brutal. Hamel clutch on a horse. Uh, not, not sure if that works. He, he's a minotaur, clearly. So, sorry. Sorry. Yeah, of course. Hello. <laughs> My, minotaur with less horns than more Plovac and Volcagio. So, yeah. <laughs> He's got little horns. He's, he's been forced to shave them down. You can see them there, look. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just horsing around. Oh, Glad Games now. Taking a, a little bit of punishment from, from Crusher. Crusher making his mark on this match. I was worried it was going to be one-sided for a moment. No. Oh. Crush is a bit confused. Yeah, yeah. He, is, he is only a Minotaur. Pops that wild animal occasionally. Amazing power for Goliath Games. It definitely having a huge effect on Crusher with every blow. Absolutely stomping a mud hole. Oh. Poor. Now he knocks him down. Oh, Crusher really Crush having to throw angry. his weight behind. Everything to get Goliath Games onto the uh, canvas, though. Whee. Oh! Outside we go. He's wearing him down slowly, though, isn't he, Crusher? He's, he's getting the job done piece by piece. Yes. Goliath Games needs to find something. Goes for the choke slam on the outside! Yeah, this is false count anywhere, so anything can happen. Changes his mind. Pulled for it, but took it back inside. Oh, yeah, trying to recover. 
There we go. Into the corner with Crusher and absolutely <laughs> squashes him flat. Oh, he's maybe going, going for, for a, a weapon. weapon, maybe. Just going for a walk. Just going for oh, a he's, walk. He's going. He's going. Going for a walk. <laughs> Taking a. <laughs> Going to the concession stand. Hiding, hiding himself between the fans, you know. Very <laughs> nearly impossible to see. <laughs> Perfect camouflage, but yeah, Cruiser, too smart. Exchange of knees. Four on to Goliath Games. Four on to Crusher, but he, he misses it. Catches it with another knee. Crusher with the headbutt, the horns. The tiny, tiny horns. <laughs> Life game struggling here. Mm. Oh, that's more like it. Oh man, look at all this stuff here. Yeah, I've never, oh, never seen weapons. this area of the arena before. Oh, oh. he's oh. at the top of the box. Well, yeah. Oh <laughs> my god. Oh no way. Oh my god. Crusher's head broken in two. Wow. The first time oh. we've seen this area in 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 like seventy two weeks of <laughs> JFW. <laughs> that's amazing. I want to see the the, uh, the trash can. Yeah. Oh, Crusher's in trouble now. Goliath Games loving this part. That's why he brought it here. Clearly yeah. an expert. Oh. Oh, big stomp. <laughs> Look at the strength. I can't believe the strength of Goliath Games. He's clearly showed he has the ball power and he's on the box again. <laughs> Oh, ooh, I thought it was going for the can, but no. Sidewalk slam instead onto the chair, onto the concrete. Crush has taken so much damage. I think a life games could just finish this now. Yep. Going for the choke slam. That's all she wrote if this lands. Oh, Crusher in trouble here. <laughs> Make the pin, buddy. Unreal. Yes. One, two, two. no. no. <laughs> Goliath Games can believe it. Neither can I. Crushing, he's too rowdy. He's too buff and too rowdy. Oh! <laughs> Goliath Games fancies him himself as a vet and neuters Crusher. <laughs> Going back, that's a long way to go. He better get there quickly. Nope, Crusher fights back. He took too long. He sure did. Trying to go up into the fans there. Yeah. Oh, nailing him with another headbutt. Oh, nice fight back for Goliath Games, though. Elbow to the gut. Oh, there you go. Elbow to the gut right back from Crusher. This is back and forth clubbing blows. So much power and weight behind them. <laughs> Only so much one of these can take. Who's going to be the first down? Headbutt. <laughs> Oh, oh busted open. <laughs> oh, <no. Whoa. laughs> Beats him into the ring area. And okay, here we are, back head. into the ring. An incredible extreme rules match this has been. <laughs> Fighting <laughs> over the Spanish announce table. <laughs> Classic uh, wrestling racism. Always the Spanish <laughs> announce table, never the American one. Yeah. That's because the Spanish one is the cheap one. <laughs> oh, Goliath Games not even moving now. I'm a bit worried, and this is the pin. It's taken a long time to come, though. That ah, took too long. Crusher feeling oh, yeah. it, though. Tired, and, and Goliath Games getting to his feet. Oh, he's back! Trying to grab Crusher. Choking him Choking out. Choking him on the ropes. ropes. Huge sidewalk slam. That could be it. Is he going to go for the cover? No, he's distracted oh, by, he's, the he's blood by the blood into his eyes. The pin took way too long, surely. 
think he had that. If he hadn't wiped the blood from his eyes first, I think Life Games had won there. Oh, here we oh. go. Oh. Earthquake smash. The avalanche. Oh, I love it. I oh. freaking love it. It's one of my favorite finishes ever. And he's, he's the winner, baby. It. Woo. Whoa. Goliath. So he's the top beast of the GFW. Holy he moly. He certainly is. I really want to see Goliath Games versus Night Demon now. If he could bring this to the table, we could have a new champion. He's absolutely incredible at the moment. He really is. Glorious. No, I won't give in. I go. That's it. Goliath Games have to. Oh, thanks for the just gifting subs there. You know, the champion knows when to share the glory. No, I won't give in. Thank you very, very much. And I will defend. I will defend. Amazing little splash, wasn't it? The win. No, I won't give in. Oh, it's such a good Until finish. John Tenter was, uh, was one of a and kind. And I will defend. Uh, I yeah, will defend. Uh, it, was, it was such a, an, an incredible athlete because he was a proper sumo in Japan before he came over to, uh, to wrestling in the WWE. No, I yeah, won't they, give the, in. The things he could do Until at his size I'm was victorious. Uh, nobody else has ever and done before. I will before defend. I will defend. Until now. Until now. Yeah. Until now. Yeah. Until now. Yeah. We've finally Glorious. got a, a sequel. No, I won't give in until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. <laughs> EAP. <laughs> EAP sound effect, something else, isn't it? Thank you so much, Goliath, for the five gifts. Are very, very nice. Thank you. Right now we have Das Hats versus Shawnee and Chugman Milk. Which are outside their uh, usual uh, ham uh, nation clothes. Yeah, yeah, interesting this. I don't know if there's descent in the ranks of the uh, of the ham lords. <laughs> Whatever their name is. Rude ham, isn't it? But it's just the two of them. And they're coming out in their own clothes, not in their... Uh, Maybe oh, wow. Goliath Games use all the oil available tonight so they can, uh, you know, they can use the ham clothes. Maybe. Lean <laughs> Gary just uh, just about to tuck into his supper and getting teleported instead to the JFW. <laughs> yeah. Once again. You'd think he'd know to have like a good stretch out on a Monday afternoon now, just in case. <laughs> yeah. He summons him. Here he comes, straight from Germany. A blue smoke bringing him down from the heavens. And he <laughs> is Lingari, confused. As always, he, he never remembers. <laughs> what happens here? So for him, every single time is the first time. It's like the movie Memento, but in the GFW. Yep. <laughs> he just has a little note. Don't trust Ori Lensis' lies. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's, he's angry. He was about to have prawns on toast and they're going to go off. Can Ori mastermind a win though and get Das Hats back on track? They're a heck of a tag team. When they're at their best, there's none better. Yeah, absolutely. The country wizard. <laughs> the weird cowboy. <laughs> a little bit of a stumble there from uh, from Lean Gara. Getting a bit jet lagged. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! 
Oh my god! <laughs> oh, here we go. They're bigging up Wank Nation actually rather than uh <laughs> rather than Rude. Wow, I mean they clearly have uh, practiced the centrance, you know, lots of work here with the pom-poms and all that. <laughs> Absolutely glorious. The coordination, <laughs> phenomenal. If they wanted to do synchronized swimming, I'd give them the gold. <laughs> I'd give them anything as long as I wouldn't have to watch. Yes, yes, just get it that way. <laughs> there you go, Shawnee with his double headset and his uh, man band. And Chuck McMill with his powerful moustache. You thought their ham outfits were bad, Jim. You should see their swimming costumes. <laughs> oh, dear Lord. <laughs> right, we've got Lean Gary versus Shawnee to start with. Both excellent wrestlers in the ring. And uh, clearly, Lean Gary has something personal against like Shawnee, like everybody else. <laughs> Nice takedown from Shawnee into a headlock. Reverse by Lean Garrett back on their feet, but now Shawnee finds himself at a side headlock. Trying to get out, pushing him on the ropes. Oh, incredibly close tip for tat this. Really mm -hmm. even matchup. Oh, and now Shawnee taking advantage of his agility. Counters the elbow, but misses with the boot. Lean Gary catches it. Boston Crab, oh, yes. Wow. That was quick. This is some of the best technical wrestling we've seen from weeks from these two. Absolutely awesome. Absolutely. Ultimately, it's though. time for the tag for uh, Chuck Mangmir. I mean, what, man what, in what the a dressing code there. What a dressing code there by Chuck Mangmir. What a true gentleman there. <laughs> Mr. Had Taylor. his champagne, he smoked his cigar, and here he is, ready to go. <laughs> Lean Gary, a working man, not impressed with the uh, with the upper classes of Chug. <laughs> well, now, Shawnee going there. back. Right, tagging from uh, from the hams. That's <laughs> uh, struggling a little bit on that front so far. Could do with a spell from Ori. Yes, in more ways than one. Yes. Meanwhile, you know, Lean Gary needs to make a tag. Ooh. Atomic drop. That's going to hurt your coccyx. <laughs> yep. And another tag, is it, from the hams? Certainly in their corner, controlling the ring. Shawnee completely focused here. Clearly he's uh, listening to recordings of his own voice on his uh, headphones. <laughs> uh, true champion. I think he's busy playing Alexa at chess. <laughs> <laughs> right to Queen 4 sometime. <laughs> Oh, Lee Gary fight back! Oh, oh my goodness! Spears! Chugs up! Chugs absolutely obliterated! He does buy Shorty a moment. He's tired though, he wants a tag. And he's, here comes Ori! Ori and there's no Chugs! And Shorty's knackered! This could be the best strategy we've ever what seen. A, in what a man. move! What a move by Lee Gary! They're absolutely destroying! <laughs> <laughs> Which really was out of nowhere. I clearly wasn't, wasn't expecting that. You don't get that at the Ritz. Chugs. <laughs> With a rude awakening, but he's back. He's recovered. And now, doing the tag. He missed He missed the tag. Yeah, he, he missed the made. tag. He missed, he missed the tag. The ref, the ref ruling. There was no legal tag there. Misses the tag or just check him out and didn't bother. This time. <laughs> oh, this time works. And now, Chuck McMillan in control here. Ori not been in the ring long, but he's already struggling. And I don't know if Lean Gary's there on the apron yet to help. Oh, he is. He's back, and he wants the tag already. <laughs> oh, wow. 
Chug's getting heavily booed. <laughs> <laughs> Just like everywhere he goes, every stream chat he's in. <laughs> About to get banned from the JFW after he went in the Chug Almond Mill. Huh? <laughs> oh, oh, massive power slam. He's got the moves though, hasn't he? He, he sure might not does. have the fashion taste. Look at those pants, <laughs> but he's definitely got the moves. What a strength. What a color combination there. So much red. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you got me going for the finisher. He wants to end this. Go wow. Oh my goodness. He ate a spear from Lean Gary. And there's the revenge. <laughs> Lean Gary's going to have to make the save. Johnny's in quick. Be able to... <laughs> Johnny. Johnny absolutely failed the there. <laughs> you try to take out the ref and the ref just, <laughs> just fucking fended him As off always, Johnny going against the rules. Hurry, trapped. Oh. Can't go anywhere. Oh, finally does find a little bit of a counter. He goes for the knee of the big man. I thought Ari would be in trouble with Lee and Gary taken out, but actually, maybe it's uh, Chuck Shawnee out on the outside as well. Oh, the oh, cheating country wizard. Oh. What a country. He's a dirty player, isn't he? His old, his old Ori. All is in the turn buckle, and now... Shawnee recovering, he's back. It's a good job too. Chug's really struggling. Oh, he's tired. Oh, he's back goes though, he is old. <laughs> he's a magician over 50. Oh. That may take down and boots him in the back. He's looking for the tag and he does need it. Chug's in the he way though, he can't there. get past the... Yeah, he can't, he can't the get past the body girl. of Chug's, it's too big. Chag. Absolutely master position there. <laughs> oh, and he stops the tag. He catches Ari and slams him down hard. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> what a master position, Ale. Uh, blue ball there, Chukman Milk. This time. <laughs> Knowing how to, you know, fill all the space. There we go. Finally. No. Yes. 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 <laughs> he carries in. Oh god, look at this. <laughs> wow. What a move. He has some strength, doesn't he? But nice counter from Lee and Gary. Oh, the exposed corner. No, the ref's recovered it. Oh. Just in oh, time. Oh, just in time. And now Lee and Gary. Great splash. Though. He's already that. tired, though. Still suffering from earlier, but he makes the pin. Sean is in. Breaks it up. <laughs> and now everybody is hitting a shoney <laughs> and each other some yeah. uh, dissension in Das Hats there yeah a bit of communication errors there this could be it if it wasn't for the fact that uh, shoney didn't really uh, feel the brunt of making the save last time and he's ready to save again oh the ref's out <laughs> Get that hat with each other. What is going on? And it's oh, Gary and now Shawnee going for Lingari. Bigger of voice. Not even the legal man, but the ref's down. He can do this all he wants. No, I think he realised he wasn't the legal man, so he let him go. <laughs> ref up just in time for the pin. Oh, here it is. Unbelievable. Oh. No, two and three quarters. I thought that was it. Lingari, Lingari is still here, not going back to Germany. Now Shawnee enters the ring. <laughs> no Ori to be seen. Shawnee just chilling out of the corner. Oh my <laughs> goodness, the disrespect. <laughs> and pays the price for that disrespect. Fans not happy with what they're seeing at all. Maybe Lingari doesn't know where he is, but he knows he wants to win. Oh, side headlock. 
No tap from Shawnee, though. Oh, maybe he's still stuck in it. He tried to fight out, but Lean Gary managed to hold on. Oh, nice. Reverse it into a side headlock of his own. Catches the boot. Horry's finally back. Can Lean Gary get over there? Yes, he can. Holds on too long, though. Shawnee fighting out. Oh! <laughs> oh. What now a maneuver by Lingari. Now time to Orelins is to finish the job. Shawnee completely out cold. What can Orelensis conjure up here? Oh, it's the wizard sleeve elbow. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Tug, not the quickest. Not the quickest. Gets caught with a bulldog, but uh, Shawnee kicked out on his own. Mm -hmm. Oh. Right back now. Lee oh. Gary completely wiped out. Ori better get this done because he's got no friend in his corner. Did, did he ever have a friend in his corner? <laughs> It's the uh, oh, it's the 150k dream. <laughs> oh, it's over! It's over! It's over! It's over! Shawnee gives up like a doll. <laughs> Sleeping spell works. Why didn't Chuck come in and save? Lean Gary was nowhere. Oh man! Das hats right back on top of things. Oh, oh, but there is dissension. Don't oh. teleport me oh. to the JFW. What are you doing? Lingari, Lingari tries of getting teleported here. That's it. I'm going back to Germany. Oh, man. <laughs> Another bride on your own. Oh, man. That's a very interesting uh, development there. You know, well, after all, you are summoning a poor guy every single week to get beaten, you know, at some <laughs> point. <laughs> Will oh. Lingari remember this next week? That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> and now, Night Demon faces another mysterious competitor. I'm going to grab a cam because it's going to be great. Yeah, weird. See now, who's crazy enough to come after the Night Demon voluntarily? It's a good question, isn't it? God knows. He's, he's been pretty unstoppable as Night Demon. No one's been able to uh, stand against him pretty much. I think he's almost run out of uh, opponents, hasn't he? He really has. He, he does the business, whoever's put in front of him, but he must be getting frustrated at these mystery opponents. Like, it's hard to prepare for, isn't it? And you don't know what you're going to face. That's very true, but I mean... Oh, Night Demon's just it's, been so... so it's not mattered yet, no. It's not <laughs> mattered yet. All right. Last week it was Skuro, so maybe this is Alpmeme. Oh my god. It's oh my god. Mighty Thug was in He's town, back. just in case Rick uh, uses him for his game. <laughs> wow. But uh, Mighty Thug has been induced in the GFW. <laughs> Almost never the case, but massive power disadvantage to Night Demon. <laughs> Seven foot tall, Mighty Zone. Holy shit. At least seven foot tall. <laughs> yep. He heard that Night Demon is the toughest in town, and he wants to check that. He's going, he's coming there. Oh, what an entrance. What an entrance. Goodness me. <laughs> Look at the size of him. You need a fourth rope to contain him in the ring. How <laughs> yeah. water on it. Well, Night Demon has a tall order tonight. Yeah. He might have his work cut out for him for once. And 
Here he is, the literally unstoppable champion ever since Helen Estelle. He has been the number one guy. No one's got even close. It's true. Yeah, he's been unbelievably dominant. Absolutely brutal uh, performance every single week. Every single week having to defend the title, having to fight a monster. And he's the greatest monster of all of them. But Mighty Sook is not a monster. He's an absolute legend. Been in Blood Bowl since New first edition. Yep. New challenge for Night Demon. Can he use his speed? Can he use his wrestling ability? Can he use his agility? Because he certainly can't outpower the might of Mighty Zug. No. Oh. oh, that's a wake up call there. Yep, goes to the legs. Nice strategy. Wait, Whoa, what? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh well. It's all good being that, strong, that isn't it? But if you can't use your legs, you can't you can't fight a man. You true. absolutely inhuman strength coming from oh, Night Demon. Sorry. It could be Fuck's over. Sake. It could be over. Fuck's sake, game. No. No. Hey, really? It's all I over. Really? <laughs> oh my god! JFW history! Alright! Alright, this is it! This is the most dominant performance I've seen! Incredible! Fuck's sake, game! You, you can't do that to Mighty Zone! You just, it's impossible! We've it should have been Griff Overworld! It should have been Griff Overworld! Mighty Zook, always a mistake! <sighs> See, Rick knew oh that's why he went with an order later, with Gahan. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was like 20 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm, I'm glad we hyped that up. <laughs> <laughs> For God's sake! <laughs> well, thank you very Glorious. much, Rick. And thank you no, very I much, Simon. Until I Lingari, come with the description. I will be there. Seems he arrived. He arrived back w, home. you, baby. Well done. Don't Ferrari, watch the boat, Lin. Don't watch the boat. <laughs> well, that must be his cousin, Average Zug. <laughs> <laughs> this was this was the the little version of Mighty Zug. I I think we saw the genius of Night Demon. Maybe we've undersold his brains in the past. He immediately targeted the leg. Taking all the strength away from Mighty Zug and then finished him off. It was, it was absolutely the perfect game plan. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well done. Well done selling it, Rick. <laughs> 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 right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.